All right, guys, this is my uh, KTM Duke 390. Uh, it's a 2017. So we're gonna be doing an oil change today. And we're gonna be changing it with the Motor X 1530, or the 1550, and then the K&N oil filter 155. All right, so the first things first, we need to take off this plastic guard on the bottom. And I'm using a uh, four millimeter Allen. So we're gonna pull that off. And then we're gonna go ahead. All right, now that that's off, we have our oil filter here on the other side, I'll show you. We've got the drain plug for the oil here. So we're gonna crack that loose, put the oil pan underneath it, get all the oil out. We're gonna pull off that oil filter. All right, I've got my 18 millimeter we're gonna use to pull that off. All right, now that I've cracked it loose, we're just gonna pull this off here. All right, now you can see it's draining out now. Let's get that in there. All right, we'll wait for that to drain completely. It's definitely easier when the engine oil is warmer, just so it flows a little bit. All right, now with an eight mil, we're gonna crack both these loose. And we're gonna get our other oil filter ready to swap in there. All right, now we're pulling out the old filter here. It looks pretty nasty. We're just going to fucking let that sit there. And then uh, we're going to grab the other filter and we're going to put it in there. All right. So now we're going to throw our new filter in here. We're just going to, you know, slide it in until it pops in there. Make sure the seat back like that. Put the cap back on, put those screws back in. All right. And when you're filling it up, that hole's pretty small. So make sure you got like a uh, funnel or something for that. And then it's very important. So this sight gauge. It shows the oil level. Make sure it's in, like in the middle of the sight gauge when the bike is level. So right now it's on the kickstand, so you can see the bike is not level. Um, so you're gonna want to have a friend tilt it up for you, or if you have a rear stand, put that on. All right, now you can see there. You can see the oil level. And then look at that, you did your oil change. And then don't forget to mount your uh, rear guard here. Um, it's the same four millimeter Allen bolts from before. And look at that, you completed your first bike oil change. 